Hello everyone and welcome back for another episode of Monday Night Gaming. We are carrying on with the Grim Dawn and in last episode we were following in the footsteps of Inquisitor Creed, tracking down Warlord Krieg uh, through his uh, various manor area up in Berwich. Uh, we've just stepped down into the basement and uh, I'll just pop back to town very quickly to sell my stuff. So we are going to hop into the rift and hop up to the Berwich Estates uh, portal. And we're going to carry on there. Um, you might think we were close to the Warden, um, but no. We have like 20 miles of underground passageways to go through before we even get close to where he might possibly live. Um, so let's get cracking and find where he is. Found some roaches. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Also, because uh, the, the foes haven't been uh, suitably scary enough, you know, in that I actually still have, ooh, uh, clean trousers. Um, so I've got myself some beer so I can uh, start drinking and make it a bit more challenging. You know, you can always go back after Gutworm by yourself if you want. Nope, I'm, qu I'm quite alright. <laughs> Not scary enough. It was quite surprising that they leveled up as much as they did. Well, I suppose it's always going to want to be like five or six levels higher than we are. Maybe it actually makes it even more challenging for um, multiplayer. Like, even higher level, not just like the extra um, mob health that you get. Yeah, it could be. That's, that's entirely possible. You see my uh, little brimstone explosions now and then? No. Nice. So then I'm really not paying attention. Oh yeah. <laughs> I would have loved it if you just said, nope, didn't see that one either. <laughs> so we're doing a, a standard uh, left wall hug, effectively? Yeah, I suppose we kind of are. Ooh, scrap. I'm wondering where all his wine is. Man, I really want some wine. Unfortunately, I don't have any. I only have Pilsner. Well, even if you did, that wouldn't help me with it. I hardly think we're going to travel across London. Oh, no, no, way. I'm not. <laughs> but, you could order an Uber driver for a couple of quid. Chances are, he would drink it on the way over. Ooh, I, I, my has reached level two. Oh, yeah, because you've actually got one of the devotion abilities, don't you? What does that mean? Let's have a look. Falcon Sweep, level 2, now does a bit more damage. Cool. Does like 2% more damage and like a few hundred more. Oh, that's good. Can you see what level 1 was to compare? Nah, but I can see what level 3 is to extrapolate. Ah. Where have you gone? Oh, you gone here. Are you checking for secrets? Because there are... Well, you already saw me bust open a wall. Yeah, um, not massively, uh, but I am looking at the map because it looks like there may be one across to the left a little bit from here. Um, but mostly I was killing everything that was uh, close by. It's getting a bit extreme up there, isn't it? It's fine, but don't worry about the blue thing. That's just me. <laughs> I'm starting to think maybe I shouldn't go from a heal. Maybe I should go from a stun skill. That looks I like a weird... I nominate you to go walking into that stuff first. <laughs> I was going to say, that looks like a weird underwater um, like canister thing. Man, that's... Oh, right, big boss. Back up a bit. You actually need a big boss? Oh, well, yeah, name... Yeah. <laughs> the dude with the big star over his head. He's on fire, the star is on fire, it's really hard to see, especially in the distance. I got a blue Mistwalker leggings. Oh, nice. Uh, what are they like? Epic heavy pants. Well, I I lose my throw feces ability if I change to it. I lose the poison retaliation, which I kind of like. Uh, I get fast moving to me. Oh. Do you want to link them? Huh, that's alright. They are I might change them in a bit. Right. 
Right, there's an underground transit entrance over there. Uh, so we've already found yeah. the warden, but I think we should loot the entire area before we move on. Ow! Yeah, that's very ow. Oh, I've got to find another way around. Okay, now it does it in, in batches like that, so... <laughs> yeah, I just... But is there actually anything in there? There's some monsters that have just spawned. What? Yeah, but I... No, th no, there isn't, but I wanted to come down to this side so I could make sure. <laughs> Alright, now to leave. There we go. It was worth it to investigate. Yeah, I am not convinced. But you keep telling yourself that. Well, otherwise, I would have always wondered. Well, you draw so much aggro. Yeah. I should have been a ranged person as well. <laughs> Still could be. No. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not going to be spec. I love being up in the middle of it all, in their faces. Yeah, it is really good having you in their way, especially through like tight corridors and stuff. Oh yeah, that's closed off. Let's have a look at the map. There's a lot more we need to explore. Yep. In fact, you know what? I'm going to change to those. I'll lose the throw feces ability. Just spinning my mouse over the uh, walls that we're running past. Yeah, it's totally worth it. More scrap. <laughs> There's a chest off to the left, to the west. I say, in case you've got your screen rotated. Yeah. Well, actually, it's not really west because I've got my screen rotated. I'm going to rotate my map so that north is north. <laughs> there we go. Now it's off to the west. So we're going to have to come at that from the other side. Back to the start. Can't help but feel there should have been. There is at least one more secret. secret. There is, it's uh, up this way. But so we need to get into this bit to find it, and it's through this wall again. Yeah. Oh, cool. Hey, draining mutant bludgeon of attack. That sounds cool. Is that a blue thing? I think thing? that's a monster infrequent. Totally just stabbed him in the back. Right. Okay. Polished emeralds. I have a new uh, dual wield technique, which I think stabs whoever I'm fighting three times in quick succession. Yeah. Yeah. Shame I don't have force wave. Shame you're not a melee person. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, what uses force wave? Soldiers, I suppose? I, I don't know. Yeah, shame I'm not one of those anyway. Wow, oh, you totally wrecked that barrel. Better believe it. Totally dangerous. Wait, was it in front of my eyes? Oh crap, two bosses. I'm in the middle of it. I'm stuck. Because they webbed me like the bastards. I'm going for the molten one first. There we go. 
I already got the other one. Two greens, fur-lined boots, and some paladins thing. Yeah, it's some more rolling blood. Splat. <laughs> okay, uh, round and round, I guess. Yep. Then pick up anything in the middle that we've missed. He was already dying. Or he attacked me and my retaliation got him, I didn't see. Or I shot him. No, nah, that didn't happen. <laughs> Splotch. <laughs> yeah, I've I reached the point where I do so much damage against some mobs that they don't uh, get the physics bouncing, they just disintegrate. But the physics bouncing is the funnest bit. I know. It's a it's a slight hazard of um oops, I actually drank that spirit potion as well. A uh, slight hazard of um doing fire damage. Ooh, unholy inscription, another rare component. That's three of those I found now. Almost enough to make a psalm. Wait, they've been this no, uh, sorry, four of the ones I found. Not all the same type though. Oh, right. That's a lot of poison damage. Oh, yes, it is. Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I was standing Absolutely. in it and my health wasn't People going up scared. even though I drunk a health potion. I was like, oh, wow, that's... I should probably step out of this. Yes, I could probably do with some base resists. <laughs> Alright, let's head back in here and get that food ration. And just look for any last secrets. We've obviously found this one. Just running around the central block. Nah, nothing there. Nothing at that dead end. Although I suppose it doesn't yeah. hurt for you to have a look around. No. It only takes a second. Right, I'm going to head back to town once we reach the uh, bit where we're about to move on. Just so I can clear my inventory. Yeah, I'll do the same. I haven't seen any more of those rovers around. See anything you like? Uh, I guess they um, either all got put to slavery or died or starved or. I'd like to think that they they're, they're, they're slaves now. <laughs> Ooh, that's all right. Requires 230 spirit though. Is that any use to you? Um. No, because I'm using the gunslingers thing. Ah, yeah, of course. Oh, this is good, though. Plus one to high impact. That's all right. 21% energy absorbed from enemy spells. That sounds good. <laughs> yeah. Yep, you're definitely going to like that. Right, let's go spent. drop this right, stuff so off I presume stash. I do quite a lot less damage with this, though. Let's see, 769 to 900, 779 to 912, ah, uh, what? Oh, cunning bonus, ah, how's my health looking though? Uh, 2069, 1825, yes, this is way better in every single way. Mutated also, scales, that's a new one. Also plus the high impact, which is which one? No, something that I'm not using, because oh, I don't oh, use grenades. That's fine. Don't care. That's nearly the wrong and way. And it doesn't look too wanky either. I look pretty spiffy. We'll see what's left. Uh huh. Where Are you sure? I said pretty spiffy. See you but, around. See, nice big golden head. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, Bling. You, look, you you look great. Look better than you. Somehow a claymore that's a decent size was uh, hiding in this tiny, tiny vase. All right. Now, other items to pick up. Um, no. Broidered hat would be my favorite. Ooh, what's this? No, that's pretty bad. How about you? Uh, I'm just waiting, uh, ready to move on. No, no, not you. I'm talking to the uh, the merchants, vendor. of course. <laughs> yes. Why would I talk to you? For the... I don't know. Stranger things have happened. Right here we go. Coming back. All right. I am just going through the wooden door now. Oh, which wooden door? Oh, you've gone on on. Yeah. That skills are ready. Made a mess. Look at all these bodies. You know what, the bodies were already room. here. I just put them on the ground. <laughs> well, they were already on the ground. I just lay them down on the ground. Well, some of them were already lying down on the ground, but when they stood up, I put them back. So you've made a mess of the bodies. Basically, you didn't even put them back where they came from, did you? No. But I'm okay with that. I tried to clean up. Stupid retaliation thing. Oh, rotting up guards. Let's throw some chaos at them instead. <laughs> Found a use for that really slow chaotic skill. <laughs> so does it actually just dance around or is it just really slow? Can you see it when I throw it? Oh, right, okay. That's what that is. Yeah. So it's the thing that Salazar was doing at us. But he less... did it he did it well. Yeah, he, he did it quickly, accurately. Um, pretty sure he had some extra control over it that I don't. Well, standing in close combat with him, he couldn't exactly miss me. One thing that's quite good about it, though, is that I can throw it and it takes so long to get there that I can curse them to be less resistant to it by the time that it arrives. Hey, level 22. Oh, that's good. Um, oh. Is this room safe? Uh, no, no, it's not. Back up. Uh, I see. Yeah. While they're That's busy, crazy. just for a moment. This tiny room off to the side that you've already cleared is safe. So you have a look there, and I'll go and kill some small things nearby. All right. Let's um. You, skill up. Yeah, you do your skills, and I'll kill a couple of nearby That's things. Skills. Yeah, blood of dream. That's gonna be my healy. And I can put the found a secret area. In. Cool. Uh, of three. Corpse dust, yes! That's made my day. Now, I think this might possibly heal you as well. Um, let's see. 15 second skill recharge, 30 second duration, 20 meter radius, 10% health restored, and gives us acid damage and offensive ability and some health regen per second. And I give you acid retaliation. Big guy is on the way. It's Ferris Bueller. There you go. I'm giving you blow of greed. He wasn't actually that hard. I already had him over right. half dead before you got here. Prowess. And it totally wasn't because he was engaged oh. in combat before he got near. What's that? Yeah, the extra chaos damage. Yeah. I mean, I don't get the battle fury. Um, what glove are you using again? Um, I am right, using... Are these any good to you? These. Okay, no, they're just way better. Can I have those? No! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, 839 to 979. Ooh, 876 to 1018. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, sorry for that. Oh, that, that Battle Fury is kind of fun. I just kind of wish Battle Fury was just attached to everything. Yeah, the poison down here is dangerous poison. Good to know. 
when it's going faster than your healing potion, yeah, dangerous. Where did you go? You didn't go this side. Mm. No, no, I, I, I went over here because uh, I, I was clearing it out sort of in the line-ish. Might have made some angry friends. That's alright, I'm catching up. I'll intercept them. Alright, so you went this way. But if you want, we can go this way. There wasn't really much that way, it was just a dead end anyway. Oh uh, yeah, I see. I just want to get my map complete. Oh, did you not go along the... This isn't a dead end. There's well, no, there, there like... was one dead end one way and then I came back to help you. Hi, I'm the back of the... <laughs> oh, hello! <laughs> Yeah, so this goes like all over the place. All right, let's let's head this way then. So this hooks up with where you just were. Yeah, and then it comes this way. So was this the dead end? Yeah, yeah that's stairs. That, yeah, but it's a dead end at the end. Well, it meets oh, up okay. where we were. All oh, right, so not even a dead end there either. Man, yeah, you are really bad at this. <laughs> Close enough. It didn't go anywhere new and interesting. I still have not yet found a single dead end in this area. <laughs> Right at the end of that, that's a dead end. Right, yes. Right, now come come to me. Ooh, I should stop looking at the map and focus on the thing that's actually punching my face. Heal! <laughs> I leveled up with that. <laughs> you could be running in and heal! Alright. I'm going to apply my uh, level very quickly. Abandoned storerooms. Cool. So we get one point into temper, and that makes us three on all of these. Nightblade gets plus one there, and we're going to put up the quick cut. Only three more levels, and we can make and use omens. In fact, we can make and use two omens now. I don't have any tainted brain matter or anything, so. Do you I need tainted brain matter? To, oh, omen, sorry. I thought you meant relics. No, no, the, the sword called omen. Uh, it's the sword of omens. Um, please do never, <laughs> ever do any, like, Thundercats or anything. I'm making two of them! <laughs> I can't help myself. Or I won't be able to help myself. No, this is the underground transit. So I think we should go back. Right now, we'll, we'll meet up with stuff anyway. Yeah, I'm just going to finish off my map bit around here. Yeah. Sorry, it's all interlinked anyway. Alright, this is the other side of that then. Mm-hmm. Oh, gosh. Things. Coming. I, I probably would be fine just by myself, but I don't want really you to miss out on all the fun. Yeah, oh, it's, it's really nice you thought of me there. I quite like this blood of Dreek. Well, the fact that I add acid retaliation to you for 15 seconds is pretty cool. I, I love retaliation. So anything it helps that, you keep aggro. Anything that gives me more retaliation is good in my book. Yeah. Well, I froze them all, so. Conceptually, it was wonderful. Ha! This guy attacked me through a wall. Ruddy cheat. This is an area that we've been in before. Right, right. so back down and round, I think. Uh, is that the fastest way? Maybe. I don't know. I'm already there, so yes. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I 
I don't like that the music just sometimes decides to go ching. <laughs> you know, like a, a musical scare type. Yeah. Abandoned like, store. There's room. nothing around. There's... Pretty sure the sound engine isn't smart enough to know when there are monsters and. Yeah, I don't heal very much with that blood of dream just yet, but it does heal a bit. Oh, I actually popped a healing potion. What is it? Um, I heal 10% of your health. Oh, so that's 200. Yeah, and uh, then give you like 8 health regen per second. Yeah, so it's, it's good. And it will get better. More scrap. Always love more scrap. Checking the walls, checking the walls. Looking for secret stores in the secret stores. Abandoned stores, but yeah. I know what you mean. I'm running with the wolf pack. There's uh, this uh, way through here, by the way. Yeah. Corpse dust. Oh, good for you. Do you need another one? Uh, no. No, I only needed the one which yeah. I've uh, now picked up. <laughs> Lodestone. Cocooned remains. And what's this? Don't pile on. More scrap. And a not so secret secret. The way out. This is actually the way out. No, I'm not convinced. It certainly feels more like a way in. Yeah. Well, this just keeps going. Yeah, I was uh, just checking to make sure I hadn't missed it. Not a way out. No, it's a, it's a secret secret. I suppose this does meet up with where we were going to go, because there's a junk pile back there that I missed. More scrap. Oh, not so much a junk pile. Invigorating embroidered raiment of attack. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like junk to me. Uh, right. Sounds like a fancy hat to me. <laughs> Another tonic amending. I'm up to 30 of them. I am trying to use them pretty regularly. Tonic and mending. Yeah. I'm over 100. Uh, 120 ish. Yeah, you should just sell some of those. Yeah, I do. Like, occasionally I just go and put them in my shared stash. The <laughs> two tonics and mending just stop there. It's just they're hardly worth anything to sell, so. Yeah. The point. Other than the space they take up. Right, back to the underground transit. And on! Oh, look, a devotion shrine. Oh, cool. Saved you. In that case, I'll have to go back to um, what's her face, Sedina, and uh, unspec one of my devotion points, because then I'll actually be able to use it for something worthwhile. You can start with uh, this is two ether crystals, so I'll just do it. Alright. Searing Ember and a Wand of Frostbite. That's so useful. Not really. Right, okay. So, I'm going into Devotions and I wanted to go for the Primordial Crossroads because that's going to give me access to Imp and all kinds of other things. So we're doing that now. And eventually, we're going to move up for the Messenger of War and this wonderful... Um, the actual Messenger of War ability. 20% chance when hit by melee attack to uh, just go into a full-on 660 piercing retaliation for 8 seconds, plus 40% to all retaliation damage. Basically, I turned into a spiky porcupine. Oh, you've headed back to town. I'll take the opportunity yes, to... Yes, I have. I, uh, yeah, I wanted to go and uh, do my things. Um, it also takes either crystals to despec devotions, just FYI. 
Okay, well, I've got like 20 billion of them, so that's not so going to be an issue. I want uh, green. I'll give you a good price. Right. I've got Actually, I didn't that. need green at all. That was a mistake. I'm D points. Ha ha! <laughs> It's, it's good that it lets you experiment and try stuff before actually committing to it. Yeah, so 15% fire damage, thank you very much. Uh, plus 10 physique and 8% elemental resistance, yes, excellent. If only I had one more point, I could get 17 elemental damage, plus 24% elemental damage and some extra energy regen, which is going to be awesome. Ah, uh, it's, uh, it's one corpse dust rather than all three bits of corpse dust that I picked up. Um, so I do need another two bits of corp dust, uh, corpse dust. Um, tough. No, it's alright, you can have one bit. I've got one bit. Be, Are you in town? That'd be really handy. Uh, yeah, I'm in town up at the um, there you go. stash. Oh, hold on. Thank you. So I only need one more of these by level 25, which I think is very doable. Yeah, because I've already got the two hollowed fangs that I need. So what else was I tidying up? That's all done. That's all done. Safe with me, promise. I think once I hit level 25 and make my two um, omens, I might start gambling with some equipment for the other slots. Yeah, I should start doing that, I think. Perhaps some fun rings or something. As opposed to the unfun rings. Oh, yeah. And I'm sure I'll get some of the unfun rings, but... Uh... The intention will be yeah. to get fun ones. I, I think it's going to end up being like a balancing act between scrap, um, iron bits, and patience. <laughs> well, I'm fucked then. Just having a look in the. Doors. Sure thing, I'm just killing some uh, heat crystals. Alright. I'm coming back. I killed one here and one down there. And the spiky thing has killed one here. Oh, Garmic's the regenerator. I'm gonna kill the, the crystal here so we're not getting extra crap spawning in. Now I'm focusing on the regenerator. Cool. Got him. Shooting your eye bolts at me. Your damn overseers. Alright, that's alright. Yeah, I actually used um, a tonic of mending. I like oh, that I came did. up with a different name for it rather than just healing potion. A tonic of mending? Yeah. Even if it sounds a bit spoony. Yeah, I suppose it's better. I should check how close we have to be um, for my heal to heal you at some point. Yeah, probably. Find out precisely what 20 yards is. Oh, you need to do some uh, full-on experimenting. Bang, ba bang, bang. Bang, ba bang, bang. Oh, bang! There is so many corpses here. Yeah, just like, aren't all of these supposed to have been prisoners? That's like, what, uh, yeah. It's like, what was the population in the area? 99% felons. That's what it was like. <laughs>
Underground uh, transit is actually just like a transit for prisoners coming in from other locations. Yeah, it could be actually. There could be like a whole prison system that we're just not seeing. Does this go through? No, it doesn't. No, no. I think it's a. It's one of those things where you will have plenty of them all throughout the game. And you kind of wonder, like, if it's you've got plenty of them all throughout the game, why even have them? I suppose it's so that if you get used to selling them, maybe you need like four at one point, and you don't have them. And you're like, oh god damn it, and then you need to go and get some more. So it's just like a little bit of extra red tape. The least Diablo sort of did away with that when it got rid of ID scrolls and then eventually got rid of healing potions. Mm. I, I liked the uh, uh, identifying items uh, mechanic, but yeah, it, it did make a lot of sense to get rid of that. I'm uh, I'm heading back south just for a moment. I just did finish... see another rift gate coming up. Just to finish off this bit of map. Yeah. Spiders. Then. Can you actually see it healing you when I do that? Uh, I see my health uh, increase, but also I get a little blood of uh, Dreeg buff on my uh, yeah. on my bar. That's because that's um, giving you caustic blood. Hmm. Ah, gotta love me some caustic blood. <laughs> Alright, what do we have here? A couple of iron bits. Hidden in. laboratory. Ooh. And another rift. See, Ooh. I kind of like this because it tends to position these rifts about 30 minutes of gameplay apart, which is really good for us because I think this is another good point to call an end to this video. Yeah, I agree. It's, Thank uh... you very much for watching, everyone. I hope you're enjoying this and uh, join us again soon for more Grim Dawn. <laughs> See you soon.